prepaid energy meter using Arduino with GSA module. So prepaid means we have to recharge this using the RC 300, RC 200, RC 100. So there should be a one uh, one recharge card having 10 units, 20 units, 30 units like that we are recharging according to the utilization of the power. Then whenever the uh, recharge completed, low balance, then uh, low balance, please recharge. There is no balance, power cut, please recharge it. So let's go for the GSM model. So if here we need to insert 2G, 3G, 4G SIM card, IDEA, Airtel, Vodafone, BSNL, SMS balance, main balance. This is lock unlock type. So open this lock and take the SIM card. Okay. Okay. So and there should be a insert the SIM card slowly. Okay. Okay. Then press it and lock it. So this is a GSM SIM 900 module. So bridge rectifier, filter capacitor, 7805 regulator and one power supply board. And this is a 0 to 9 volts adapter power source. 9 volts adapter power source is given to the GSM module. And here we are converting into 5 volts power supply. SPDT relay and one energy meter and one AC bulb, 100 watt bulb. 16 cross to LC display. And what, whatever the pulses coming, we are giving to the op amp LM358 operational amplifier. That output voltage should be goes to analog A0 and it will calculate continuously so lcd connections are 8 9 10 11 12 13 those are connected to the 16 cross 2 lcd display output relay coil it is connected to the seventh pin okay so now we are going to start the output okay prepaid energy meter using gsm and arduino gsm testing connected echo finding network Test message. Okay. So balance is zero. P is zero. Okay. Units is zero. Okay. So there is no balance. That's why the unit should be not on. So we are reaches. We are recharging this. Paste RC three hundred. But I will go with hundred rupees first. RC hundred. Then send. Okay. Ash capital S dot RC hundred recharge power on recharge hundred rupees. Yeah, bulb on. Okay, recharge amount is hundred rupees. Success. So there are twenty units. According to the twenty units, continuously uh, that that will goes on continuously decrease. So whenever it decreases, ultimately. Whenever reach that uh, low 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 balance, then it will send that. So, no balance power cut. Low balance, please recharge. So there are RC hundred rupees, RC two hundred and three hundred is also there in our project code. So here is eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen LCD connection. Bulb is connected to the seventh pin, and analog zero uh, energy meter is connected to the A zero pin. Okay, so GSM based prepaid energy meter and billing and counter. So we are calculating that bill. So here RC hundred. So we are hundred rupees balance. So we are uh, recharging the balance amount. Okay, so RC two hundred balance is two hundred. RC three hundred balance is three hundred. Like that we are recharging. Okay, twenty eight. So whenever the pulses come coming onto the G energy meter, so that red LED, the pulse, whatever the pulse coming, that pulses we are going to give the Arduino board. That Arduino board will calculate that. Whenever it reach the amount, hundred rupees recharge success a low balance. Okay, low balance please recharge. So units is zero, balance is zero. Okay, power cut, power cut, and we will get the um, written SMS. Okay, so energy meter, energy meter LED is also closed. Okay, and uh, no balance, power cut. Okay, so no need to touch anything. Okay, once again, we will go for the 200 ash. Ash capital S dot RC two hundred three hundred now 
then I am going to recharge with 200 ash capital S dot RC 200 then start there is no spaces okay SMS received power on recharge 200 rupees okay bulb is on so 199 balance amount is 199 40 units 100 rupees 20 units for 100 200 20, 40 units 360 units okay so rc 100 rupees 200 sorry 100 300 okay like that we are recharging okay so whenever power gone okay whenever the power gone so that last data it showed into the internal e prom okay so whenever power came so remaining continuously goes on okay so we recharge with 200 now so continuously goes on those pulses so whenever power gone and after power came the remaining balance will come through internal e prom so it continues we are storing continuously pulses onto the internal e prom okay thank you